السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ مائی نیم از نور اسلامی ابراہیم نمبر نمبر از ریس 1824 ٹو دی ایوی تاک اباؤٹ انٹروڈکشن ان دی ماڈرن ورک اف گروئنگ ڈائیورسٹی دی ہاسپیٹلٹی سیکٹر مس فائنڈ اے وے ٹو سیٹسفائی اٹس کسٹمر ریلیجس ڈیمانڈ دی ہاسپیٹلٹی سیکٹر ٹرائز ٹو میٹ دی ویریس کلچرل اینڈ ریلیجس ریکوائرمنٹ اف دی کلائنٹس ون سچ ڈیوٹی Uh, that is frequently is regarded as leaving Muslim travelers instruction to the Qibla facilities for and facilities for praying. So we can see in the introduction we have purpose of study. Purpose uh, of study is first is investigate how prayer facilities and Qibla direction in hotels and restaurants influence effective uh, catering for Muslim clients. Second, uh, make it easier for Muslim to worship. And last is respect for diverse culture and religious. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Nurul Iman Bendi Shubli and my metric number is H22B0051. I would like to present about case description. Firstly, is recognizing the importance of accommodating cultural and religious preferences. The hotel launched a plan to enhance its halal gas experience management. Next, is the case study highlight the importance of proactive halal gas experience management in the hospitality industry. And for the last point is, by providing prayer facilities and key blood duration, hotels can create a welcoming environment for Muslim guests and fostering respect and appreciation for their culture. That's all for me. Thank you. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Taj Bin Shukri. My meeting number is one 8 2 5 7 Today, I will explain about problem identification, key issue and challenging phase. Providing prayer facilities in interest and accommodation is challenging due to limited space. It's requiring respect for different cultures and religions. Integrating this space definitely shows sensitivity to diverse belief. However, the cost and regulations involved in setting up and maintaining this area can be significant. Next factor contributing to the problem. One of the biggest challenges is financial limitations. Often prevent us from offering enough prayer space. Next, providing prayers, prayer facilities is dealing with older buildings that were not designed with this space in mind. By understanding our, our guest need and making prayer facilities a priority, we can create a more welcoming environment for everyone. That's all from me. Thank you. Result and outcomes. Implementation of solution. First, data collection. Utilize industry journals, report and case study. Second, survey and feedback. Gather guest feedback to directly measure certification and identify areas for improvement. Then, academic research and experts consultation. Leverage insight from cultural sensitivity studies and consult with experts to ensure comprehensive impact assessment. For guest certification, enhance experience for Muslim traveler. And for cultural inclusivity, promote diversity and inclusiveness. Lastly, business performance. Potential increase in guest loyalty and market share. Impact assessment. For goals, improve business performance. For key areas to measure, conduct survey. For data collection method, survey for users and non-users. Stakeholder engagement, internal, collaborate with hotel management and staff. External, work with the local Muslim community. For reporting and implementation, summarize finding and insight. Provide actionable recommendation, develop and monitor action plans. For continuous evaluation, adapt to evolving guest needs. For outcome, gain insight into the effectiveness of facilities. Hi, okay, for this part, I will tell about what we can learn from our study. Every industry related to the hotel and restaurant must have complete surround facility that is to have the correct cable direction. With such facility, it will give a little good feedback from the customer and it will improve the image of the company. Hi, my name is Fanny Sanajwa binti Saman, H21A2043. I'm going to talk about conclusion. In conclusion, hotels or service must offer Muslim-friendly service. 
to unlock the full potential of Muslim travel. Next, this case study is very important for Muslim because the Qiblat is used to pray and worship, which is obligatory for all Muslim wherever we are. That's all from us. Thank you.